Muslim women they cover their hair because of their husbands. They go to meet those people as a Muslim person. You dress in a certain kind of way and also have your head covered. welcome back to my channel it's a girl here again peppy to all my new subscribers i see you guys thank you so much I appreciate you guys so much thank you to my oldies thank you guys for the support if you're coming across my video for the first time or you're seeing my face for the first time please do well to subscribe and also do not forget to turn on your bell notification button and that way you can get notified whenever i upload new videos so guys on today's video like i'm gonna be making this video from the last two videos i did i yeah. think i'm talking about is i think that video was about um a muslim friend of mine that gifted me a dress a muslim dress that she bought from mecca a worker my colleague at work okay also a friend she got me a dress Agbaya, Agbaya. I don't want to make a mistake again, guys. Because the last two videos, I made a mistake pronouncing the name. I mean, you know, the long Muslim dress with a scarf. So she got me that dress. So I made a video knowing few Muslim people here and like my experiences, how they are be more Christian than Christian people. So, so I also tried on the dress on that video. So if you've not seen that video. I think the second to the last video I made, go take a look at it. So on the comment section, like when I was going through the comment section, I saw someone uh, made a comment about, okay, this comment was made my, by my friend, Vanessa, because I also think Vanessa, I know of a Muslim friend that she, um, what's her name again? I forgot it, but I know she also has some Muslim friends. So she made a comment and said that most Muslim women cover their head cause of okay cover their hair cause of their husbands. Okay, so like their husbands made them to cover their hairs. So under her comments, I was going through the comments under her comments, and there was a particular girl that said that she's a young Muslim and she's not married, has never been married, and she does cover her hair. And she doesn't cover her hair because of a man. So there were just other few comments. So I had to, when I went back to work, I asked my friend, because my friend also watched the video. So I then asked her, why does Muslim women cover their hair? You, she's married. Do you cover your hair because your husband said you should? Or it's just because she covers her own hair too. So why do you cover your hair? She now said it's not because of the husband. Okay. That there are so many reasons why muslim women cover their hairs but it's not because of their husband because there are single muslims out there that also cover their hair and it's not because of a man so on today's video we'll be talking about some reasons like why muslim women cover their hair and after watching this video if you think there are other reasons that you know why they cover their hairs which i didn't state on this video just feel free put it down in the comment section because i want to so know so many why. reasons there are various reasons why muslim women chose to cover their hairs the first one is because of modesty many muslim women cover their hair because of privacy and dignity okay and this thing is something they chose to do on their own which is according to Islamic um, rules. So Islamic rules stated that women are supposed to have their hairs covered, but it is states that like is a must. It's not, it's not something that is being pressurized. Like it's not like if you don't cover your hair, you are not a Muslim or you're not a proper Muslim. Just like in Christianity, they said we should cover their hair. Uh, hair also in church but when you come to europe or some churches also in nigeria they don't cover their hairs in church so for a muslim a muslim woman that covers their hair most of them do it out of dignity out of modesty out of privacy also according to according to the islamic so teaching the next reason why muslim women cover their hairs is because of culture as in, uh, cultural traditions okay some 
some countries that are predominantly Muslim uh, people, like you will see that women there cover their hairs mostly. Like it's it's like everybody have their hairs covered. Is because of the culture. Like they grew up seeing this, and then they get integrated, and then they start doing it. It's like a cultural thing. It's like, it's like a cultural thing. That's why they end up doing it. You know, growing up in predominantly a Muslim place where almost everybody have their heads covered. You when you when you are growing up in that kind of place, or when you grow up in that, in that kind of place, you try to like follow up. It's like a traditional thing. It's like a cultural thing. That's also one when, when one of the reasons why they have their heads covered. If you Try to understand the next why. The reason is cause of identification, identity. So, for instance, now, if I'm walking on the street and I see a woman with a headscarf and a long dress and everything, automatically I know this person is a Muslim. So, some people go out with their heads covered and with the dress just for identification you don't need to tell someone i'm a muslim when somebody sees you they automatically knows that you are a muslim so some people go out with their head scarf because of identity because of identification so you know really that this person is a muslim is respect muslim women cover their head out of respect i've been saying hers but like it's the whole thing hairs and the head they cover their head out of respect in certain social contests, like they get their head covered out of respect, especially when they are talking or relating with elders and all these authority figures, it's just a sign of respect. So the last lie I think um Muslim women cover their head is cause of religious obligations. Some interpret the Quran verses, that is the sayings of Prophet Muhammad, as mandating that women are supposed to have their head covered. So they do this to oblige or to be respectful. Uh, they practice or they try to, like, they practice what the Quran says. That, that is the saying, some of the Quran verses, but I don't know which verse particularly said that women are supposed to have their head covered. If you know, put it in the comment section because me, I want to go and read it, okay? So that is the saying of Muhammad, uh, Prophet Muhammad. It's like a religious obligation which is supposed to be done and which, of course, people are supposed to uh, respect religion obligations and do what the Prophet Muhammad said that they are supposed to do. So some women have their head, both young, old, small, have their head covered because of what the Prophet Muhammad so said. so important to know that like I'll be ending this video very soon. It's also important to know that Muslim women, uh, the covering of their head varies for different reasons. It's cultural, religious, and personal factors. Okay. Muslim community, there is no age bracket for you to cover your head. Like my friend said that little kids, babies are not obligated to cover their head. But it's just out of choice. But I think she said from the age of, um, I think from the age of 10 or 11, I can't remember what she said. Probably I think age 8, 9, 10, 11 and up or so, I expected to have their head covered as a Muslim. But these things is out of choice, okay? It's not a must or it doesn't mean that if you don't have your head covered, you're not a proper Muslim or all that. It's still out of choice. But just like we have um, all these uh, very strong Christians, we also have like local Christians, you know, the every Sunday Christians, like they know they carry uh, Christianity for head. There are people that carry this on their head that they, they tend to dress in a certain kind of way. They don't wear revealing clothes. They don't wear skimpy clothes. Like they, whenever they attend church, they have their heads covered with a scarf. Like, so it's personal factors. So is that also a Muslim? But I think Muslim people tend to like practice it much more because we have a lot of, a whole lot of Muslim people that cover their head.
okay so it's just like it's not a must and they basically do not do this cause of men because when you see a muslim woman on the street with a man the man is like dressed open uh like putting on a t-shirt or their long sari and all that and the woman is covered from head to toe it doesn't mean that the husband forced her to dress up like that no it's out of choice it's out of religious ob obligations it's out of cultural obligations it's out of personal factors that is like they are obeying the words of Muhammad. That's their choice. That's the way they chose to dress. So they don't dress up because of a man or because because there are a lot of singles out there that always have their head covered and they don't have a man, but they are they are still covered up. So that's basically everything I want to say on this video. So if you if you like this video, like this video, share it if you can and also do not forget to turn on that bell notification button you can get notified whenever i upload new videos because most times you upload the video if you, your notification bell is not turned on you might see you might be getting like you just stroll be strolling on youtube and just come across the video but if you turn your bell on whenever i upload this video you will get a notification that i upload that whenever you have time you can watch the video so thank you guys so much do not forget peppy loves yourself bye mm -hmm.